<laughs> Naomi is a 16 year old girl who was adopted. She's a military kid. Everybody loves Naomi. <laughs> You wanna join the team? Well, we finally won a game. <laughs> she knows nine languages. She's in six AP classes. Her mind is always working. Ohayo gozaimasu, ohai dekte urashiras. She rides a skateboard. She has like the funkiest, coolest style. She's nice to everyone, and she has a really good moral compass on her back. Naomi runs the number three Superman fan site in the world. In the minds of everybody, superheroes are just comic book characters. There's no way that Superman's real. What's going on? Superman. <laughs> There's a sighting of Superman in the town. Not only is it real, it's happening in your face, in like where you live. Superheroes aren't real, right? When he turns up in the town, her senses are all very, very, very all over the place and kind of amplified. This seems oddly personal, and she wants to get to the bottom of this. Of course I believe you but we're gonna need help. Your friends are there with you no matter what. You always know what's going on, especially if it's about Superman. She's very passionate and she's unapologetically herself. You think I'm pretty? <laughs> His like confidence is just unmatched. <laughs> yeah, but you're you. Anthony has a big old crush on Naomi. I've never actually done this before. She will give you some wisdom, but she's gonna have a weird way to get there. Can we have code names? I call Elrond from Lord of the Rings. They're all friends. Well. They're all acquaintances. Awkward. I think we found something. There's something amiss. Do you guys know the guy who owns the tattoo parlor? They might be trying to hide the information. Sometimes people aren't who you think they are. Is it real? Is it a stunt? What's happening? Most people think it's a hoax. There's more than meets the eye. It can be hard once you realize you're not like everyone else. Stand up! Working with Ava DuVernay. <laughs> I can't even believe I'm saying that right now. Definitely a hero of mine. It really made me step up. I can't give you answers when you're not asking the right questions. She puts a young woman of color to the forefront. Who gets to be the hero? It's beautiful to see, and we need more of that on our TV screens. I'd say you're in for a ride. Are you a superhero? No. No.